Hundreds of people in Minnesota and Wisconsin joined law enforcement from both states today in escorting the body of a sheriff's deputy. Katie Lacing was shot and killed this weekend in St. Croix County, Wisconsin, while responding to a driver in a ditch. WCCO's David Schumann shares the powerful display of support for the fallen officer. Draped in the American flag, Katie Lacing's body was brought into a funeral home in Baldwin, Wisconsin, surrounded by dozens of law enforcement officers in solemn salute. The St. Croix County Sheriff's deputy was never alone on her trip from St. Paul to Baldwin. Hundreds of people lined the streets and bridges to follow the police procession. It's just a terrible thing. It's a terrible thing. So I'm here just to support our police. People are just going to come out because, you know, we're a tight knit group in St. Croix County and we're going to support this officer on her way home. The Wisconsin Department of Justice says Lacing was responding to a possibly drunk driver in a ditch in Glenwood Township Saturday. She asked him to do a sobriety test, but he was, quote, evasive and eventually pulled a gun and shot her. It is sad. Like, I don't like it. Like, they don't deserve to just die like that. Like, they're just trying to keep us safe. The DOJ says Lacing fired back three times but missed, and the man, Jeremiah Johnson, ran into the woods. During the search, they say an officer saw Johnson shoot and kill himself. Lacing's the third Western Wisconsin officer to be killed in the line of duty in the last month. Shatek officer Emily Breidenbach and Cameron officer Hunter Scheel were shot during a traffic stop in Barron County. I'm sick to my stomach, actually. I, I am disgusted with the fact that all of these officers from all of these different departments just did this three weeks ago. Becky Brock felt it was important to bring her daughters to see the procession. We can be supportive of the police department, of the firefighters, of the helpers is what we call them in our house. Look for the helpers and all of these helpers are being supportive of each other and we're supportive of them. In St. Croix County, David Schumann, WCCO News. Deputy Lacing was 29 years old. The St. Croix County Sheriff said we will miss her infectious smile and personality.